Okay, this is just a little short one on using the infrared uh, point click temperature probe to see if your connections, contactors, all those sort of things are actually making good contact. Uh, these are not real good. This is a cheapie here. Uh, it works, but it's not real accurate. But the one thing it will do is check the temperature of potentially overheating terminals. Anytime we have uh, one wire hooked to another spot, like right here we got a terminal, that terminal, if it's loose, if it makes bad connection, it'll heat. The contactor is the same thing. Here's our contactor, and the contacts across here, if they're not making good contact, they're going to heat. Uh, these temperature uh, probes are pretty good for this. Uh, sometimes I think that's about all they are good for, but uh, let's go ahead and test this. Now the first thing we're going to do is take an ambient test. Now that is saying 39 degrees. Okay, if I place it straight over here and I put it as close as I can, there's no temperature riser at all. If I go to here, I got maybe, well, no real temperature rise. Most important one is here across these contacts. Okay, what I've got is about 43 degrees. Now over here, and in the ambient, I had about 39, 40. Uh, up here, got maybe a little more right there, 44 and 39. So the rise, the only rise I have is right there uh, in the contacts. That's pretty much telling me where I have any heat build up at all. And I can go over here to these parts here. They are running power through them too. Uh, maybe just a tiny bit off the capacitor. That's about it. None of this stuff is bad enough to really be concerned about. I am not overheating these things. And uh, the machine should be running for at least five minutes before I do this. Uh, this should be a part of any service, uh, pre-winter, pre-summer, where I have uh, high load contacts that have a lot of amperage going through them, then I should be doing this kind of check. So these things here actually have a pretty good use here for just that uh, that point of temperature. Uh, I would use these things in uh, pretty much every job I go on. Very quick uh, way to find out if there is any potential problem. Because remember, all these terminals should be tightened. And in this case, I would tighten them anyway. However, this is telling me if I got a problem there. So that's a uh, good way to keep terminals from burning up. Remember, these things will burn up big time if they get loose. Because they start losing heat and they will burn up. And that's all for contacts and taking their temperatures.